The Cash for Clunkers program ends tonight, and there's a final mad dash to trade in those gas guzzlers. CBS News correspondent Terrell Brown is in Woodside, New York, with the very latest. Good morning, Terrell. Julie, good morning to you. Yeah, 8 o'clock tonight, 8 p.m. Eastern, those applications have to be in. And so with that in mind, car buyers all across the country flock to their dealerships to trade in those clunkers for up to $4,500 down on brand new, more fuel efficient cars. <laughs> At this Honda dealer in New York, Steve and Linda Elaine joined the frenzy of last minute car buyers before time ran out. Why did you wait until today? Because I heard Monday is the last day. So I told her, let's go today. Elaine saved a hefty $3,500 through the Cash for Clunkers program. He purchased the first new car he's ever owned. Yeah. A Honda Accord traded in for his 98 Ford Explorer. Yeah. Over the weekend, car buyers packed showrooms across the country. Cash for Clunkers sent new cars off lots in a record-setting fashion. Oh, it's beautiful. Just my size. They hit a home run with this program. There no Brian Benstock says business at his Honda showroom has been exceptional. One car. Every 10 minutes. Every 10 minutes. We're not selling coffee here. We're not selling donuts here. We're selling twenty and $30,000 automobiles. And we sold the car every 10 minutes yesterday. As of Friday, Toyota, GM, Ford, and Honda grabbed the biggest slices of the clunkers pie, together racking up about two-thirds of sales. Everybody did well because everyone sold more cars. And, Julie, we'll get the final numbers, of course, later on this week. But as of Friday... 483,000 new cars have been sold under this program. Incredible. Terrell Brown. Thanks, Terrell.